What's going on everybody? Today I'm going to teach you guys how to process a photo with uh, a Photoshop script called the sauce and that's right over here in our actions window here. Um, to install this in Photoshop you're going to come up here and go to your window and then actions and then you'll be presented with your actions window and then you can go over here and go to load actions and then you can start loading scripts individually. This photo here is going to go on to a 12 by 12 white tile that's been painted black with Rust-Oleum X2 Canyon Black spray paint. Um, so first things first, you're going to bring your photo in, come up here and go to image size. I already have this set at 200 dpi and size is uh, gonna bleed over the edges of the tile so you won't have any black borders or anything so go ahead and press OK and now all you're gonna have to do is come over here and highlight the first step of uh, the saw script here and press play my computer's a little slow so bear with me here it's now automatically processing the photo for you and it's very very universal across many different substrates wood, tile, aluminum, leatherette, leather, acrylic painted white I mean uh, white acrylic painted black, clear acrylic, painted clear acrylic you name it you can pretty much use this process on just about anything here Alright, it's just about done here, and once again it's 200 dpi, currently zoomed in at 28%. This will probably run much faster on your guys' computers. Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and zoom in for you guys. We're at 28% right now, bring it up to 66.6. Take a look around here. And now we'll zoom in. 100%. Now when we're burning our photo, we're going to want to make sure that we see all these little details, the little specks in the, the darkest blacks and the eights, the little specks in the brightest whites, okay? So now we'll get to it, we'll save this, and we'll save it as a, a BMP. Alright, so then we're going to make sure that the radio of Windows is checked there and one bit. Press OK. Now we're going to head over into Lightburn here. And this is the uh, shape of my tile pretty much here. So I'm going to fit the image within this boundary. Okay. So you're going to enter some settings here. Um, this is pretty much my go-to settings for uh, white tile painted black with this process. Uh, it's going to be a negative, so you're going to want to make sure negative is turned on. And also pass-through mode. This is very important. Don't skip this step ever. Um, make sure that's green. Press OK. And now we are going to send it over to the machine. Alright, once this uh, downloads to the machine here, I'll, I will switch over to my cell phone and record some video of the tile burning. You guys doing? Okay, guys, welcome back here. Uh, we're over on the machine. We have our file uploaded here, our photo. And we have a white tile painted black. And I'm going to go ahead and press start. 
it's probably going to overlap the bottom edge here a little bit, but that's fine. And we'll just wait patiently for it to uh, get up onto the uh, tile here. Keep in mind this photo is 200 dpi, so when we get in real close to it, we should be able to easily see the pattern. As you guys can see as we start moving along here and I move the camera a little bit further away from it it really starts coming together so basically if you're gonna have something hanging on the wall or sitting up on a shelf you know you can you can use the low resolution like 200 dpi such as this photo here and it will look very nice from a viewing distance. If you're going to use higher resolution, use that on your smaller photos, such as uh, keychain size. And then all the, probably go up to about 600 DPI, maybe try 400 on a keychain size, and just make sure you burn all the all the small little detail there, and the character's photo will uh, end result will be very good. We're zoomed in pretty close here now. So far, so good. Running uh, 31.1% power and 219 millimeters per second. So 
60 watt laser. Now my settings probably are not going to work for you guys, so make sure you guys uh, follow my first video of how to use this script here, and I'll show you guys how to calibrate your machine settings. Without the guesswork, so. Alright guys, I will uh, take some more video as this progresses. Thanks for watching. Um, I'll probably splice all three of these videos together, so make it one video, make it easy. Thanks for watching. Hey guys, we're back. We're just about finished up here. This is our 200 DPI photo that we processed uh, just a little bit ago in Photoshop. I'm going to bring you guys in closer here and show you guys all the fine detail of 200 dpi. This is what we're looking for, burning all of the detail within the process photo, and then your end result will be just how you want it. Alright guys, we're back here, we're uh, just about finished here, 12 by 12 tile, uh, painted black with Rust-Oleum X2 Canyon Black. I'll get you guys zoomed in here.